Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Kiwi07 with 808 rating versus Yuchi Hongari with 1406 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video, and we're going to see Kiwi win the Rock, Paper, Scissors shoot, and they will decide to go first, 43 versus 40, opening hands, we have Oliver, Nib, Gear Freed, Museum, and Heritage, they have Gamma Seal, Scream, Gamma Seal, Tear Cash, and Havnas, well, they have potential... Um, cause Havnus plus Tear Cash, you know, opening both those together, pretty good. But they're gonna Heritage in the OG air, and then activate Museum, pay 12, go search to Rendal, uh, normal OG air, effect, and then looks like the opponent has no Havnus to activate, so dump Turpin, and then Durendal, go search Renault. I mean, like, you could definitely drop this, cause if you hit any tier card, you can summon Tear Cash. That's, that's a lot of mills, and you still have another tier card in hand, so you can mill Rhino. I guess maybe just saving it for the Assault effect. Um, then they're going to go Renaud effect, add back to Rendell. Uh, on the Renaud effect, activate Havnus. Maybe just wait until they have more bodies on the field. Uh, then they mill Medora, Tear Cash, Talons. New Chain Link, Tear Cash effect, mill two. And then that mills Kelbeck. And then Kelbeck effect, both players mill five. I mean, it's actually not the worst for the opponent because, I mean, they hit Roland. That's pretty decent. You know, if it's sent to the graveyard end phase, you get to add the fire. This is also good in the graveyard. Um, you can banish that to get a free summon. But they mill a Guido Scream. So now they're going to go a Guido 1, Scream 2. Uh, they're going to grab Solik. Okay, probably should have done it the other way around then, right? Because we could have milled Solik and got a nice search. Yeah. Could have done it the other way around. We know they don't have Ash otherwise, right? They would have just Ash Kelbeck. But now they mill Keldo, Scream, Solik, Murley. Okay, 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 yeah. So a new chain link. They said thinking if I want to fuse. Because, like, they don't have anything in the graveyard to fuse with. So they're literally going to have to fuse off field and hand. Which sucks. They could make Garua. Like, I, I wouldn't hate Garua. But that's it. Murley 1, Solik 2. So they're going to go search for Rhino and then put back Murley, put back Havnus, and put back Rhino. Okay, I guess add the Rhino to put it back and then bring out Kaleido and then Kaleido effect to spin. Spin OG -er. Uh Now they're going to go OG -er effect to equip, which will allow the Turpin to summon itself out. So they're going to activate Medora, put back OG -er, the Ricardido, and Turpin. So the three that will actually do something this turn. Uh, like, rolling adds during end phase, but, like, who cares? It's not actually going to do anything. So, put back. Um, okay, now we have... We have Gear Freed, we have Oliver, we have a used Museum. We're going to go activate Durendal, Durendal effect. Go search out for Turpin, and then destroy Durendal. Oliver effect, discard Turpin, special summon itself out. Gear Freed, banish Durendal, summon. And then Turpin effect to equip Chain Keldo to banish and put back the Turpin, the Roland, and then the Kelbeck. Yeah, I mean, having the mill fives in the deck are just so broken. And, like, now we only have 22 cards. So, like, we have a lot of good mills left in our deck. We're going to go into a sold effect. And remember, you know, they still have tier cash, but they want a tenth of that. But a sold, grab out Roland. And then activate Tear Cash now. So we're going to Banish Scream special. So it doesn't play Grief. Otherwise we would have Banished Trap. And then activate the effect to make themselves mill 3. And they mill Super Poly, Murly, Super Poly. Okay, Murly's the name that they've used. So now we're going to go Kaleido on a Sold. Yeah. I mean, that doesn't work. Because we put back OG here. And that's once per turn. Yeah. They said, sorry, multitasking, you're good. They're going to go Oliver effect, equip, and then a sold go dump once. Like, can you put a counter on who's equipped to? It said, bro, might forget. It's on a sold. Okay, museum, summon out, and then use those to go into Angelica. You know, the red on wasn't a tuner. And then Angelica, go search for museum. And then they're going to banish, grab Phoenix Blade, uh, activate Phoenix Blade on Angelica, chain it, dump Turpin, summon Captain Roland, 
and then they're going to go activate museum over museum, pay 12, go search, go search out Owl Mace, and then banish, banish, grab back Phoenix Blade, activate Owl Mace, and then activate Phoenix Blade, Turpin effect now, summon itself out. Uh, then we're going to go up into Charles, new chain link, Owl Mace effect, grab back Oliver, uh, Captain Roland effect, equip, and then we could use the effect to pop, pop Kaleido, Kaleido effect, chain gear freed to negate, and then go into link one, and then link one effect, equip synchro, so now that is going to gain its effects, so it's spell trap, negate, plus a pop, and then end phase, Emperor Charles the Great, equip Owl Mace, and then we're going to equip the Magius, and then summon back out Angelica. They draw hollow. Okay. So, they said main phase good? Yep. Summon out Gamma Seal over the link, which is the pop and spell trap negate. And now they're going to get Owl Mace chain link 1, Magius chain link 2, put back and draw. And then that draws in the Heritage. Uh, Owl Mace still gets to resolve. Looks like they forgot to do that though. Captain Roland effect, equip the gear freed. Activate Scream, Special Gamma Seal, Scream Mill 3, Mill Havness, Havness Effect, Chain Gear Freed to Negate, and then move to Battle Phase. And then they're going to beat over Gamma Seal, beat over a Sold, not bad, Set Solic, End Phase, Rolling Effect on Angelica, Chain Angelica, Banish Dump. Uh, this is supposed to go to Grave, right? Yeah. I don't see why this wouldn't go to grave. I guess maybe it's different because it's in the hand. Um, equip this to that target as an equip spell. No, I feel like this should go to grave, right? It's kind of like using like Thousand Eyes Restrict on like ABC Buster. And then you chain ABC Buster to banish Thousand Eyes Restrict. And then ABC Buster goes to grave because it's still trying to attach. Um... But okay, draw on the nib. And then they're going to think here. They're going to go effect, equip to the gear freed. And then move to battle phase, gear freed, attack, gamma seal, effect to take the tier cash. Uh, they said thinking. Whoa. They're going to go solic. Okay. So on the attack, they're going to slow it, gear freed. Okay. Oh, that's kind of sick. Magnus effect to equip the gear freed and then gear freed send it and then you're going to get that effect to draw I like that so even though it's negated we still just want the draw Then mill king of the swamp plus tier planet and then effect to shuffle back and then draw And then we also get to put back captain Roland, which makes our angelica Nice a little bit better um, But we're going to go attack attack and then rolling effect also that's not at 17, because it's at 12, because Scream. But Angelica's going to dump the og -er, bring out Captain Roland, Captain Roland attack. That's also a nice way to get, like, more damage into og -er effect to equip, Turpin effect to special, and then use those two, go up into Emperor Charles. Uh, then special Renaud, Renaud effect to add back DDR. Okay, uh, use Gear Freed plus Renaud to make Baron, Banish Gear Freed, Renaud, add back Phoenix Blade, and then we're going to go Phoenix Blade on Charles, go up in the Emperor Charles to Great. We could have pop Scream, uh, but go into this, effect, equip Charles, effect, pop Scream now, Scream effect, go search for Trap Card, and then grab out Meta Noise. Okay, uh, Baron effect, pop Solik. And then they're going to go Solic effect to go search, chain Emperor Charles to negate. Yeah, the opponent just admits defeat. Now uh, they're also going to have gear free too. So on to the next game. We're going to see Tier go first. We got Nib, Talents, Ogier, Almace, Renaud. They have Polly, Shaylin, Scream, TC Boo, Super Polly. Okay, TC Boo is pretty good against a Warrior deck. But their hand's also not great. They're going to go... They said this is quite the hand. Activate Scream, Normal Summon out the Shaylin effect, Mill 3, Mill's Beast. Field spell terraforming and then beast draw one that draws in the talents. Wow, such super poly TC boo pass. They draw ash blossom, normal OG air, OG air one, scream two. They decide to not ash it. Maybe they would have, but 
in the middle pretty quick. They're gonna kill King of the Swamp, Scream, Fenrir. Uh, they dump Gearfried, new chain link, Scream, go search for a trap card, grab out Solik. Said can't wait to be windowed. If you have Cosmic, it's wraps. Yeah, they said if. If. Talons draw red layer Talons. Uh, I said I didn't use an effect, lol. I said Drew Talons and red layer. They said you're good. So they're gonna put back. Wait. They said that activates to summon? No. It doesn't, lol. Don't think it does. It's late to be honest. I, oh, okay, like, okay, 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 like, it's late time-wise for you, I was gonna say, I don't think the opponent was asking to respond to that, it doesn't activate, but summon Renaud, effect, grab back gear free, now gear free in the hand activates, you can tell if a card activates or not, because it'll have that little, almost smiley, winky face to it, but not with the smile, and then they're gonna go super poly, discard, bring out Garua, Okay, uh, I mean, they still have TC Boo, but yeah, I was going to say, the opponent's going to get gear freed now. Is there a world where we could have flipped TC Boo? Nah. Like, flip TC Boo, they send one of these, they keep OGR, they crash in the Shaylin. Yeah, I, I think we should have flipped TC Boo, right? Yeah, now they're going to go OGR effect to equip, because now they get to go battle phase, which takes the tier body off board, which means the scream isn't live, and it takes the just, just takes the bodies off board. We would have been able to link with Guru at worst. Yeah, that was a misplay. They draw King of the Swamp, and then set Solik pass. They draw Talons, gear free to attack, and then pass. They draw Called by, they said 500 more, never mind scream. I... I don't even know what that is supposed to be. Oh, from the turn before, okay. Um, set King of the Swamp, set Called by, pass, they draw Red Lair, and then Gear Free to attack over King of the Swamp, pass, they draw Tear Cash, activate Tear Cash, uh, then they're gonna go Gear Free to negate, and Tear Cash effect, Chain Ash, and then Chain Called by. So Banish Ash, they mill two, they mill Kelbeck, Kelbeck effect, they said no way, that's a good one, said you're the best player in the world well it's not like i mean last game they milled kelba kogito but they couldn't even activate a fusion summoner from the grave so it's like i don't know are they really the luckiest player but they milled rhino rhino keldo metanoise tc boo and then they mill oliver museum heritage new chain link metanoise effect add back rhino then we can normal rhino rhino one scream two so, Mill, Scream, Hollow, Dump, Havness, New Chain Link, Havness 1, Hollow 2, Scream 3, Go Search Crime, Mill 2, Mill Tear Cash, Tear Cash, Put Back Havness, Rhino, Shaylin, and then bring out, or bring out Kaleido, Kaleido Spin Back, the Gear Freed, which is going to now allow our Guru to activate. We've already used Tear Cash to Mill, so we can't do that. Uh, we draw on the Murley. Uh, I was going to say we technically could poly. No. Can't even poly. Yeah. We can't even poly. Okay, this is fine though. I mean, you know, it's it's in hand for crime. We have this. We just didn't attack. Yeah, okay, sure. Never needed to. Kind of want to play around evenly. Oh. I respect that actually. I respect that, because now we have Crime to play around evenly, so no point of attacking. Because we have Crime plus TC Boo, right? Like, that should just be game. Summon Red Blair. Uh, then they're going to go Scream Effect, Mill 3, Mill Rhino, Medora. They said, bro, you too good. I mean, they hit another Shuffler, but they can't even activate Kaleido there. Because no Aqua is something great, but they can do it at a different time. They're going to go summon effect, try to bring back from grave, chain TC boo, they scoop. So going on to game three now, we're going to go ahead and see Infernoble go first. Opening hands, we got Gear Freed, Ricardito, Cosmic, Connector, Renal. They have Solik, Murley, Gamma Seal, Rhino, and Tear Cash. So normal Connector, effect, bring out Aqua Dolphin and Defense, effect. Now what do we hit? Because we don't have to hit Murley, even though we could destroy it. Yeah, we're going to target Gamma Seal. And then we lose 500, and then use those to go into a soul, a soul effect on summon, go search, grab red layer. Now, wouldn't be surprised if the opponent tries to tear cash. They said suck. Yeah, I was going to say, I wouldn't be, wouldn't be surprised if they tear cash here. Because it really just is like a tear cash and prey type of moment. 
Otherwise, if you try to wait for your turn, you know, you have a trap, two normal summons. Like, you're not going to have that much to push through everything that they have. Bring out to your cash, affect the mill, I said they mount the bill. About the mill, Agito, Kelbeck, and Medora. They mill Metanoise, Medora, Rhino. Oh, wow. The last mill was really what they needed. Rhino effect, and now they also have Medora alive. Which is pretty strong. Um, so Rhino Effect, and then Summon, Discard Murley. And then Rhino Effect to go dump, Murley Effect to Fuse. I mean, I... Ooh, okay, okay. So you have two options here. You could dump, like, a Shaylin, or, like, whatever. Dump an Aqua, and then put back Murley, Rhino, on field. And the Aqua we just dumped to bring out Kaleido. Kaleido spin is sold. Or we could Murley effect and Rhino effect. And Rhino dumps tier cash. Murley puts back itself. Rhino on field plus Gamma Seal in hand to summon Kaleido. And then we have tier cash mill two. Um, so it's like, do we want to mill two cards? Do we want to have Gamma Seal in hand? Because I wouldn't hate if we kept Gamma Seal over million two. I really want to, you know, I mean, overall. You know, this is, like, guaranteed what we'll have versus a blank mill. So I wouldn't hate that. Oh, Infernoble just leaves there. Yeah, I guess if they get spun back on a sold, their next play is, like, well, they just added Red Blair, right? Just to make sure. I'm, like, 99% sure they just added this card, but I guess just to make sure. Yeah, added Red Blair, okay. Banish, Summon. Effect, add, pass, lose. Could have also just put the opponent on half something after getting hit with Kaleido. You could literally just like set Cosmic Pass, Cosmic the Tear Field spell, or maybe a Scream. Hope that you somehow live, and then if it comes back to your turn, maybe they don't have any interruptions. Could have at least tried. I mean, it was only going to take like an extra like, you know, 45 seconds to see if it was going to actually happen. Just let the opponent resolve their combo on your turn, pass. But, alright, with all that being said, that's going to be it for the video. We're going to see Tier uh, win there, and seeing how long the match was all together, about 31 minutes long, and the DB Grinders signing off. Peace, have a nice day, stay safe.